What's up everyone, it's Liam Catterson here, and today we're going to be reacting to Red vs. Blue, episodes 10 to 12 of season 11, which the first one is... Long live the king. I tried to do my best scar voice, but I'm not in the mood if I've got this cold. Um, <laughs> so yes, we have got Freckles, who's causing a disturbance at Red Base, uh, at Red Base because... Sarge is uh, going through his crazy stage where he thinks that the Red and Blue War started all over again and it's like... Um, whereas Simmons has now moved into Red Base, uh, Red Base, Blue Base again. So he's going through that phase uh, that he sometimes goes through where he has his preference sets to the Blue. I think he's secretly a Blue. I think he's secretly, like, he just loves it so much. I mean, they've got the clean facilities there, they've got chores, and, that, and that's what Simmons was getting off to, whereas Griff couldn't give a shit, of course, because, you know, that's not Griff's thing. Um, maybe before the Epsilon vision did change him, of course, like, when it was Epsilon Griff. But, uh, yes, uh, it's all bizarre at the minute, and uh, I can't wait to see what uh, goes on. So, without further ado, episode 10 is Long Live the King, let's go. As long as I'm leader of this team, I will do everything in my power to ensure your safety, whether you like it or not. We don't need you protecting us. I know. That's why I'm I think you do. To help you. Help us with what? Defending against attack? No one is going to attack us. Attack! Here we go. There's, there's the reds. <laughs> Red versus blue is happened all over again. Episode number ten. You have literally the worst timing. <laughs> <laughs> No longer fraternizing with the enemy. Oh ben God! Ben. Now, see, when he says we, imagine he's only referring to himself. Yeah, it's uh, like he said. He didn't ben, come up with this idea. One. I think. What the hell are you two doing? Uh, again, not two, just him. Can't stress this enough. <laughs> Poor Griffin. He's, he's just getting dragged along. But we can work together as one people. Sarge, you're just off your nuts. We can all get together and be a little purple. <laughs> can be a little bit of doc. Oh, God. Who? Me? What's kidnapping? If she came over here by himself, we can't he get to see. He volunteered. Uh-oh. Traitor! Traitor! What did I do? You're fucking disgusting, Griff. Well, yeah, but I've always been... Right, imagine having to put up with someone like Griff. Sorry, I'm the one that decided to take half the base for himself. True. Oh, then I guess it is your fault. True. He could have, he could have let... Oh, for God's sake. Oh, go on. Uh, yeah, no <laughs> reason for panic. Everything's fine. Might anyone have a rolled up newspaper? And <laughs> you were kidnapped. You deliberately joined the enemy. But if he wasn't kidnapped, that would mean we were never the enemy in the first place. Exactly. Don't try and confuse me with your words. D just Sam don't. I'm Aqua. Calm down. Me? These guys roll up in a fucking assault jeep, and you choose to yell at me? Exactly. Look, tensions are high. No shit, Washington. I'm tired of you bossing us around. Now is not the time. Oh, you know, no. I Oh, here we go. It's heated. It's heated. I mean, them two were trading some roasts, Sam. Worst thing to happen to this team since Blue Boy over there decided to show up. I'm a man! Blue man! You take that back. Oh, damn. Oh, shit. Here we go. Everything's just going down. I would rather follow Caboose into battle than you. Oh! Now let's just make him the leader. See how much better I'm Yes, Caboose the leader of Blue Team. Yes. Shut up! Uh oh. Oh, demoted. Oh, dearie. Freckles is just taking everything. Oh, shit! Freckles laid down the freaking law! I think it's going to be a great no, future if Caboose in charge. Look, Freckles, this is a misunderstanding. Caboose nope. team leader? Fuck this. <laughs> so he's going back to the red. So that was shot and sweet. Oh no, he's not got a choice. <laughs> well... He what? technically did anyways. Uh, hey, Sarge. Now the blues have kidnapped Simmons. Yes, now it applies. <laughs> Wait, stop! 
Oh my god! <laughs> this is fucking nuts! This is nuts! <laughs> what was that experience? <laughs> Go on, Lopez. I'm afraid I won't be okay until I exact my revenge. Oh no. Hodge just. Poor Griff, he's just getting distracted. Oh no. Oh? That wasn't either one of them. Was it the guy that was spying on him? Man, you guys are really noisy. Yay! Yay! Aw, you must have really missed me. No, things are just. <laughs> <laughs> the things you got out of control. Where's the ship? What ship? The ship you came here on, the rescue team. Oh, <laughs> duh. Allow me to introduce the rescue team. The doc? Wait, what is this? Crying out loud. <laughs> These two. <laughs> Great. You didn't pay me. <laughs> I didn't tip the pilot. The rescue That's team. Reality. What pilot? The pilot that dropped us off, dummy. Dropped you off? As in. Not here anymore? Exactly. Well, this is great. Uh, Fantastic. So you're telling me. <laughs> We're stranded here. You heard our distress signal. Grab Doc. Hopped on a ship. Yeah. And then told the ship to leave. And that's your Paul, idea. Paul Washington, he's just losing I, it. No. I brought Lopez too. Lopez what? Oh, God, no. <laughs> <laughs> this has been fucking nuts. <laughs> Who the frick are you? Unfortunate. What's the deal with this guy? What is the deal with this guy? I mean, he's saying unfortunate, so. <laughs> My god, that was probably the most nuts episode ever. Like, Sarge just going. Frickin' ballistic. Kaboo's being promoted to team leader and then Freckles just laying down the law. I freaking love that so much. <laughs> um, I don't know. That was just completely nuts. And then Doc and Donut just showing up out of the blue, of course. And, um, you know, they're still stranded here now. They were, they were going to be rescued. Thanks to that, uh, thanks to Washington's talk with Donut across the radio, but now that's going to hell. Yeah. Unfortunate indeed that they're stranded here. Uh, episode 11 is Worst Laid Plans. Let's go. Man, this is just nuts. This is it. <laughs> this is Rock Bottom. Yes. You ever hit Rock Bottom before? Turquoise Boy. <laughs> He's well, not laughing any of it. He's like, this lost it. Can't get any Got demoted. Now control. he's realized he's stranded. Okay, well, maybe I spoke too soon. Attention, officer on deck. Oh, God, this is just... <laughs> oh, thank you, Gantel. Thank you. Welcome, I'm digging Gantel. this Kaboo story. Thank this is the best. Hello. Captain, all team members are accounted for. <laughs> Oh my lord. Hi. This is just this like is just a painful a in, uh, yes. like in death yes. with the blues. Yes. Welcome to Blue Team Tim. <laughs> it's good to have you on board today for the Blue Team. Sir, awaiting mission briefing. Oh, oh god. Yes, right. God, right. Yes. Um, okay, um Yes. First order of business is um uh, <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> this was the. Wash is just done, okay? He's done with this shit. He's not gonna. Wash. Yes, Caboose. What is the first order of business? Mr. get rescued. And that went down the shitter. Did anyone have any suggestions? <laughs> well, we know the communications tower works, so yes. we should continue in our efforts to make contact. Ah, yes. Very good. Excellent, yes. However, 
We should also work on trying to boost the signal of the radio transmitter. We were barely able to maintain a steady line of communication. Yes, because it kept crackling so it all out. Contact again. There's no guarantee anyone would be able to understand us. Uh, yeah, uh, right, yeah. Then, then we need to do that. Tucker, go fix the radio thing. <laughs> he, why not watch? He's the one who built it. He's the uh, one who's. Because don't broke it. All right, listen. Okay, you watch it for another job. But. Uh, oh God. Oh God. Yes. <laughs> yes. Just I, follow it, up. It, it, just you know, uh, what he did is mean and scary. Then, then he will be our lookout. Lookout. For Washington, make sure you look out for, for? bad guys. Yeah, like and who? I mean, Sarge just thing? lost his nuts. That looks scary. There's a giant robot trying to kill me. <laughs> yeah, why can't Rebels yes. be our lookout? Yeah, that why can't? Like his entire reason for existing. He's putting well, the foot down, uh, so. Every great leader needs a great best friend. And Freckles. I think you could be that best friend. <laughs> Makes sense. Acknowledged. Um, do I need to do anything? Oh my god, a red! Oh, my. oh, oh god, sorry. Sorry, that's my bad. Go sorry. on, come. Sorry. Yes, good, good, good stuff, Caboose. Good stuff. Yes. You have um, to respray his uh, armor blue you again. You, uh, god, this tea is just freaking cold. Red. But it's dead. For the blues. For the blues. <laughs> uh, yes, sir. What is your job for the Reds? What do you mean? I just did it. Okay, everybody! <laughs> Ass kissing. Alright, see you. Bye. <laughs> I'm just loving Caboose. Yes. Hey, don't pin the I shoe love on this. Me. I am. Uh, just clean up. Yeah, stay just. Here, I guess. <laughs> just, I don't know, make the uh, right. floor a bit cleaner or oh, whatever. You can't feel my toes. Is that normal? Um, let's go with yes. Works for me. You know, the Good next stuff, time Doc. someone Good comes stuff. to help you, I wouldn't really recommend beating the crap out of them. Well, the next time somebody <laughs> comes to help us, I hope they actually bring us help. Yes, hey, instead of just taking off. To that. Yeah, it's called an insult. Oh. <laughs> I, I mean, I Doc's not the greatest, is he? Tunnel. But you guys were supposed to be going back to Blood Gold. I mean, they. Well, uh, I mean, the rescue story. team took off or whatever. So the pilot, oh my yeah. God, who spilled soda all over my instrument? Oh God. Oh my God, I spilled my soda. Somehow the ship crashed, but uh. No one seems to know why, or how, or when, or... Man. I didn't do it! You can't prove that I did! It's time for Oh, we're not gonna do anything violent, are we? Remember, I'm a pacifist! Yeah, but yes. Can't spill pacifist without fist! Oh, God. But, uh, no, 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 oh. The precursor to a full-out battle, which is ultimately the first step on the inevitable road to war! <laughs> Poor anyway, Doc. Father. Yeah, oh, why, why on, do you Doc. even bother? Where's your sense of this adventure? Just... We're a bunch of strapping young men stranded in the wilderness. If that doesn't sound like a good time, I don't know what does. <laughs> I'm not sure remember why I don't like you. <laughs> <laughs> camping! Who wants to help me pitch a tent? Yep, there it is. <laughs> Living in this godforsaken Erect a hole, tent. We've let Washington make all the decisions. And just look where that's gotten us. The war dog is destroyed. We're running low on food. And Simmons yeah, I wonder why. Shit's pretty fucked. I mean, I can understand Sim uh, Simmons being right taken pri uh, taken prisoner because that's not well, legit. The Reds are revolting. Revolt. Well, that's. <laughs> Stop kissing his ass, Griff. Oh. Freckles, isn't it? Boys, you've got to kill Freckles. You can't kill Freckles! You can't kill Freckles! Uh, we don't know who that is. Yeah, they... Got here. Yeah. Hold on. You mean Lopez? Oh, for God's sake, no. Creo, I think they're talking about... Oh, I'm gonna love this Lopez and Lopez to too. AKA this is that will fucking kill us if we get anywhere near it. So exactly how do you plan on eliminating it, Sarge? Well, well, if our ship was carrying something as big as Freckles, I figure it may have also been carrying something big enough to break him. We're going aboard the ship? We'll move in tonight. Donut, Ooh. you guard the base while we're gone. Awesome! Hey! Uh-oh. You guys haven't seen anything suspicious around, have you? Well, uh, I have, suspicious? but... Why, whatever do you mean, Agent Washington? 
doing my job. <laughs> Poor like Washington. Very <laughs> well, to be fair, nobody has a clue what that like is going on in course, so he didn't really that much convincing. I mean, Washington's just done, done with everything. Oh, that guy looks a bit um, happy. Man, I'm just. This is just bizarre. Ooh, is this hey, a... can I get some fuel on three? You got it. Thanks. Hey, uh, I'm not really from around here, but, uh, do you know about that crashed spaceship? Spaceship? Yeah, I do. I just dropped off a couple of guys and saw it in the middle of the canyon. You're the responsible big. one. <laughs> like, really big. No, I can't say I've heard of it. Really? Oh, man. I think you're bullshit. <laughs> I mean, someone should report that, right? Well, that's so to you. Yeah, it was pretty bad. You got a phone I could use? Sure. Right behind you. Thanks. Ooh. No witnesses. Just so you're aware. No one's gonna find your ship either. This guy's a dick! Control, this is Locus. Okay, Locus. Just Returning to crash site, bravo. He's trying to keep everything, like, clean, isn't he? Shit! This guy's a bitch! Now I look like I've been balling out to twice upon a time again. Ugh. Don't get it. Whoever gave me a cold, I'm gonna punch them in the face. <laughs> um, Locust, then. Obviously a piece of shit. I mean, that was the guy that dropped off, um, Donut and Dark, of course. But he's trying to keep it, so he is. So he looks like he's going to be the main bad of this season, or probably the main. Tr I don't know. I mean, he was. Um, he seemed to be working for someone, so maybe he's not like the main bad, but he is one of the like, fo like probably the most focused um, evil of season eleven. So, because this is a new uh, trilogy, um, so. Yeah, they're obviously building or something, but um, yeah, shit's picked up now. But it's still funny. I mean, season eleven. Uh, at the minute, I mean, yes, I can see why people are saying it's slow, like there's not much going on, uh, we'll go back to the usual red versus blue stuff, and the very serious story stuff we're getting is only in minimal doses so far, so, um, not that I'm complaining, because this, like, these last few episodes have been really, really hectic, especially with the lo uh, not locus, um, the freckles and, uh, caboose thing, where caboose is now in charge, it's just been really, really bizarre and, um, and I want to see more uh, of the two Lopez's discussed because there's obviously that difference now that uh, Lopez 1.0 is here there's like a more happier Lopez 2.0 and then there's Lopez who's just done with every uh, shit going on um, so I just hope that they don't destroy Freckles but if they do then we riot this is Finders Keepers episode number 12 the last one of today let's go I don't know the first thing about fixing intergalactic space radios. Uh -huh. <laughs> Every movie I've ever seen with a repairman in it always glosses over the actual repairing part. It's just, hey lady, I'm here to lay some pipe. And then bang, <laughs> two scoops of razor. Uh -huh. Damn it, woman, if you let the man do his Paul job, Simmons. maybe we wouldn't He's be in this mess. Hey, Tucker, what the fuck is this thing? He has to go listen to Tucker's he bitching. It and it takes you upstairs. Well, I know it's that. But what the fuck is it doing here? It's glowing and going... It's obviously active, so... We're survivors of a shipwreck, living off of the bare necessities, and in the middle of the room is this incredible feat of modern day technology. Yes. I don't know, Wash found it on the ship, and so we put it in the base. What's so weird about that? It's like finding a car made out of rocks, plastic, and a Bluetooth radio. Oh, we've got that too. <laughs> Siri, play, song, dance uh, team. Oh, God. Did you mean Bob Andy? Oh, piece of shit. Calling Bob Andy. How are you able to oh, Andy. all of this? Andy. Andy. to the ship. You mean you have a direct line to a limitless power supply? Well, no, we'll definitely run out of fuel eventually. Just not anytime soon. So who cares? Take as much as you want. God bless oh, the nice. American way. Nice. What are you gonna do? Just a side project. Hey, <laughs> Well, unlimited power of it. No bad guys to be found. Excellent work, Commander Washington! Ten I out of ten. Fire your determination! Why? Maybe someday you could be the leader of Blue Team. <laughs> Maybe someday. <laughs> I have a very important question for you, Washington. Okay. Um, do you think Freckles would look silly in a hat? 
No, give him a top hat. A little bowler hat. I don't sombrero. Okay. I'm I'm just saying a bowler hat. You know, I just remembered I haven't checked for any bad guys on the ship. Oh, because he's doing his own little thing, isn't he? Deviated away from inventory. Sorry, boss. I'll take care of it right away. Hmm. Yeah, some people are just not cut out for military life, Freckles. Let's go make you that tiny hat. Thanks, Wash. Really looking out for your team. Hey, you've reached the voicemail of Andy the Boss. Andy! There's another guy. Wait, what? It's actually them. Oh, that's uh oh. It's that guy. Wait, what the hell? I'm I'm confused. I what? Who's this guy? Why is this guy he, like bad? Why? I'm confused. I don't like no, being confused. What's this guy? Nice. He's got locus. Why, We don't know. <sighs> somewhere else. Yeah, that's pretty bad. Hey, did you guys ever watch Lost? Shut up. <laughs> Spoilers. All right, man. Fan out and see what you can find. Remember, we're hunting the most dangerous prey of them all. Man? What? No. <laughs> Giant robot. Oh, yeah. Man. Everything kills man. Man's yes. right out on the list. Right between koala we're and weak. koala. Yeah. Man sucks. <laughs> we're weak. We're pathetic. Hmm. That could work. What yeah. the fuck? Not really. Oh, it's a bomb. It... Run, Griff. Run. I wouldn't just stare at it. It might. Ex Ow. Oh. Headshot. Griff, what the heck, man? What's? Now don't be a bitch. What is this? Beats me. You wanna try? Exactly. You don't know what it could do. It could have. A... I'm not sure. It could be a nuke or something. Come on. They don't do anything. They just stick. Well, let me It's getting think faster. About it. It's getting faster. Okay. Hey. This ain't a tea party, Nump Skulls. Get rid of those toys and get back to work. Fine. I oh, thought man. he was going to think about it and then it would just explode or whatever. Okay. I never get there we go. Cool. It's going to explode. There we go. You better Ma not be breaking things down there. <laughs> now imagine if that was on Doc's head. Records, it was carrying a lot of standard issue weaponry. His, but his head would be flying. That would be. That would be. Uh, epic. Especially for your Lopez. That military sling for really fucking dangerous. <laughs> Where's that stuff? Uh, looks like most of it was on the other half of the ship. Boo. But there is one prototype that was kept here. Ooh. Oh. Oh. What the fuck are these? Looks like some kind of weird grenade. Or it could be a Rubik's Cube. I don't know. Huh. Ah! What are you that doing? That is weird. Trying it that out. Looks... Oh. Oh. That... Okay, that's... Whoa. You that just disappeared. Did you see that? You can't just go around oh, no. with experimental... Stop doing that! It's just testing it out. Oh. Dude, what is wrong just, with you? These things are like teleport yeah. cubes. <sighs> Be careful. We don't know how they so work. So you could. What do you mean? Throw another thing, which, thing disappears. Throw for, another one, and it comes back. I could keep an entire buffet in the palm of my hand. Really? Oh, we would, wouldn't. Oh, it's froze. Okay, so that's annoying. Don't go on Sky, people, because they screw you over. So where were we? Um, just. Okay, we we're, we're past that. Okay, I'm just trying to find. Right, we're at the teleport thing. Okay, right, let's go again. What's wrong with you? Please don't screw up. Like teleporter cubes. Yes. Uh, be careful. We don't know how they work. What do you mean? Throw another thing. Thing disappears. Throw another one. And then it comes back. I can keep an entire buffet in the palm of my hand. <laughs> really? That's what you're talking about. Yeah. Yeah, oh, I, I bet he would. No, I bet he would. No. Oh, I am taking these. <laughs> Sorry, you'll never guess what we found. Son, but they could be really useful for freckles. You got a napalm shark. I still wouldn't care. What? Oh. You know that feeling you get when you see a pretty girl on the first day of school? Yeah, I just you're faint. You're not quite sure what to do, but your instincts just take over and you smile at her. And she smiles back. This is really passionate and stuff from Sarge. The world is a brand new place, and your stomach is a whole new world. And <laughs> um, yeah? Well, boys. I got that feeling right Something's now. hit Sarge in the feels. Some... Holy shit. Oh Not no! We're gonna have a Metal Gear fight! Yeah! And outfitted with 50 millimeter cannons and ammo for days. Oh no! Pretty high maintenance. She sounds like I need a safe word to date her. <laughs> yeah! So how will we get it out of the ship? Uh, teleportation cubes, anyone? 
No. A girl this fine's gotta be treated right. Oiled up and whatnot. We'll take her apart and move her ourselves. Limb by limb. I, I think the teleportation thing is a, is a bit simpler, but no, yeah, yeah it's not I just think your dating metaphor kind of took a turn into serial killer territory there, Sarge. Seriously? I just found these awesome future kids. Exactly. Griff's using his brain for once. Uh oh. Uh oh. Oh, Washington's up to hey, this. Is it? Oh, shh. Oh. Doesn't matter. Let's just discover. It's good. I base. I see back what he's up. doing now. Take her back to our lair. I mean base. Could you please stop referring to the robot as a woman? It's really weird. <laughs> Not as weird as the hey. direction she's given me. Jesus Christ. I didn't know Sarge was Tucker. Damn. So wait, is he gonna use uh, that hmm. uh, assault droid? Conductor. Because that's what he was going to. Okay, so I see what he's going to do. He's going to try and over. He's going to try and use the caboose and that. Caboose has his pet. Washington. Go. And when is Tucker going to have his pet? Although uh, he'll just probably bag it. To come down to this. Sorry, caboose. We're going to have a user. We're going to have a user. Love it. Well, at least it didn't uh, fail on me uh, for that second part. Um, which is it's going to be annoying in the editing reel, but uh, yes, um, that was really so. It seems like that machine that uh, oh, there's going to be a bit of a squabble going on now with Washington and the Reds, of course, because the Reds are going to use that to try and take because we we know the Reds have their own agenda, of course, by taking because it's red versus blue to them all over again in their perspective. But of course, Washington needs that mech, of course, for a usurp against Caboose, so. We've got an interesting dilemma going on at the minute um, at the Reds and Blues, of course. But then there's that guy. Um, I'm sure that was Lo uh, Locus as well, like, on the top where he was like, oh, shit. Um, I don't know who that guy is, but there seems to be two mysterious characters. Lo uh, Locus, that we've already gotten accustomed to. He's a dodgy sort of a bitch. But who's that guy? I mean, that guy seems to be fearful of, of uh, Locus or something like that. Um, but, that but the way he said... Holy shit, it's actually them. It's like, I don't know, he is for them or something like that. Or they were a myth or something uh, to them. And he's like, okay, well, we got to, um, we got to, like, I don't know, get on in on the myth and that. And uh, now he's got there. So I'll have to find out more about that guy, whoever he is. But, um, yeah, it's just been an interesting turn of events these uh, these episodes. But Red vs. Blue Season 11, it's just been really, really juicy. Yes, like I said, it might have been a bit slow paced. It might be a bit more slower than, you know, your usual season, well, the past few seasons of Red vs. Blue, but it's certainly proven to be a really interesting one. It's still fun to watch. It's still really juicy, intriguing, and... I'm just intrigued to see where things go from here for Red vs. Blue Season 11. Now we've got a second mech droid, and things are going to go off the rails pretty quickly. So I will see you guys next time. Hope you guys enjoyed this reaction. You can check my videos on the right if you want to check out more of my content. You can also subscribe to my media feeds and channel if you want to. Hope you guys enjoyed this reaction. Hope you guys take care, and I will see you guys next time. Toodles! Ooh. No.